Hi Aries, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Aries, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Aries. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Ten of Swords, and this is Air Energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius Energy. So this is a card of a painful ending, a breakup, it, and it can even be a possible betrayal. There's an energy of putting something really devastating behind you, like the worst that could happen has already happened. There's that kind of energy of uh, picking yourself up after a major disappointment or um, heartbreak here. Yeah. So let's see. We have the Two of Pentacles, Earth Energy, the Justice card, Libra Energy, and the Five of Pentacles in the reverse, Earth Energy. So it does look like whoever you had this ending with, they still think about you. Um, this is someone who feels guilty. You know, with the Justice card, they could feel like they want to apologize to you. Um, this person could have, you know, ended things with you in a very hurtful way. Like they could have just ghosted you or they could have... Uh, you know, betrayed you or cheated on you. There's something here about the way in which they ended things with you. It was quite cruel. And they. this is weighing on them. You know, they are thinking about whether they should or shouldn't come towards you and apologize for something. Um, with the Five of Pentacles being in the reverse, there's an energy of wanting to come towards you, like to reconnect with you after, you know, having had distanced themselves in some way. So let's clarify these cards. Um, Aries. Okay, we have the Ten of Pentacles, and this is Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy. So yeah, this is someone who you, you may have thought you were going to have this for happily ever after with them. They may have looked really good on paper, and they may have kind of just taken you by surprise with something they did that was very hurtful. Okay, so let's see. We have the Seven of Swords in the reverse, Air Energy. The Five of Cups in the reverse, Water Energy, and the Chariot, Cancer Energy. They definitely are coming towards you. This is someone who, who feels like they owe you something. They owe you a truth. You may have exposed them or caught them in a lie. And you may actually already be moving forward with, from this. Like This is something you have to really pick yourself up from and you know close that door or put that behind you. And it could have been really hard, but it's like you you managed to do it. This situation may have really proved how resilient you are and how strong you are. And now this person is like they feel pulled towards you with the chariot. There's an energy of feeling like they need to approach you. Um, with the justice and the five of pentacles, it's possible this person has experienced some sort of karma. And they do want to, you know, come towards you. Okay, so I'm going to pull out an oracle card for you, Aries. we have a win-win outcome is forecast full moon in libra okay so yeah you could be getting some sort of um, apology or someone wanting to right their wrongs the scales have been balanced in some way and this person may be wanting to tell you about that
okay, we have attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. So this person does feel very attracted to you. They could be coming towards you. Let's see. we have thankfulness for understanding before we can forgive one another we have to understand one another so they could be wanting to apologize this is someone who's going to give you their perspective um what has happened they're going to look for your compassion and understanding as well as trying to get your forgiveness okay so i'm going to pull out a card for your advice um aries we have surrendered to wonder and awe open to the magic of every moment and sense the awe and wonder in all of your life this attitude will keep you connected to the ecstasy of flow okay so that's what i'm seeing for you aries i hope you have a really really good day aries bye aries